Empty any stray coffee by pulling the lever. Fill the hopper with coffee beans and pull the locking slide open. Start the grinder. Pull the doser lever to line up your full coffee slot as the next pull. Fill the portafilla basket with two full pulls, which equals about 14 gram. Distribute the coffee equally by tapping the basket with the palm of your hand. Press using the pressure of a warm handshake. Keep the elbow up and twist like turning a doorknob. Dust off with the palm of your hand. Flush the group head. Insert the portafilla and lock it. Immediately press the double shot button Start the timer and have the cups in place. Hold the steam wand by the rubber sleeve. Clean the nozzle after each use. Point it down and use a burst of steam to clean the nozzle. Empty the basket like this. Clean the basket. Fill the steaming pitcher with milk just under the neck. Put the steamer wand in so that the nozzle is just under the surface of the milk and hold the jug at this angle. Hold the bottom of the jug as you are steaming and when it becomes uncomfortable to hold because of the temperature, turn it off. When making a cappuccino, you are lowering the jug to make the double volume. As you can see as the steamer is on, the milk will start spinning, you lower the jug and it doubles the volume. When the temperature gets too hot for your hand and it becomes uncomfortable, turn it off. It is ready. Tap the jug to remove the bubbles. Spin till the milk is silky and glossy. Give the coffee a quick spin to reset the crema. For a cappuccino, Tilt the cup to get closer to the coffee, pour close and fast. For a latte, hold the jug at the same angle, with the tip of the nozzle at the same amount of depth. Allow the milk to spin, but this time you do not lower the jug. When your hand feels uncomfortable because of the temperature, then stop the steamer. Tap the jug to remove the bubbles. Spin the milk until the milk is liquidy and paint-like. Give the coffee a quick spin to reset the crema. For a latte, pour from afar, circle the cup and near the finish, pour close. 